All right, guys, it's a really windy day, so if all you hear is wind, I apologize. Um, we're out here at Uligaw, me and D'Angelo again. He looks like that scientist off of Sonic the Hedgehog. So we're waiting on D to catch the, the record fish. He said we're not leaving today until he does. So we're out. Uh, any day now, D'Angelo. What's going on? So it's so windy, we decided to fish along the bank here. There's a bridge. Bridge's over there. And caught uh, four, four and a quarter pound catfish. So now we're just waiting on the fish to bite. Check it out. Speak this to resistance. In 10 minutes, we'll be back with my fish. 10 that's minutes. Right. Me, that's who. Y'all heard him, 10 minutes. What time is it? So yeah, if it's windy, I apologize. We're using live shad. Uh, a couple Carolina rigs, a couple Santee rigs, a couple drifting rigs. Um, one suspended line or two suspended lines and using live shad so and worms Woo. anyway i got a fish is the camera on you I'm D'Angelo. <laughs> Got a little bitty blue right here. I'm gonna go ahead and let him go. He's not worth keeping, but look how fat he is. Look at that. Fat belly. Fatty. <laughs> Thanks, buddy, for letting us catch you. All right. We'll be back when D'Angelo catches his fish, and we're about 70 years old. <laughs> Still on there? Is it a nice fish? It feels, it feels decent. It's swimming towards us. Got a fish live. Y'all know who got it. Let's see what it's talking about. Woo, it's a keeper. It's a nice blue. It's a keeper. Look at that right there, boy. Oh, shit, no, All right, don't break nothing now. Those are my worms. Think three pounder, four pounder, four, three point eight. Come on, bro. Three point eight. That's a nice fish right there. It really is. Hopefully, we get some more to go home with it, huh? Taking them home regardless. Yes, sir. So we got a, we're using live shad. D'Angelo made us stay here, and I'm glad he did. Cause I was just losing hope today on fishing, and I threw it out far. And hey, this one was actually on bottom. It was sitting on bottom; it wouldn't float. So we got live shad. Probably a little four pounder. I'm away, and we'll find out. If I catch another one over here, we're moving. If you want to move us, we're not going to get it. I don't think we're going to get no better. I don't know, man. I'm cutting to right over there. I'm talking about better than that small one being steel. Oh. Oh, 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 Got one? Yeah, I think so.
D'Angelo got a fish. Let's see what he got. Do I need the net? I don't know. I can't even feel it. Oh. Oh. Yes, you need the fucking net. Woo! Fishy! Oh. This thing is fighting on this pole, bro. Oh, you better not. You let it pull, let it pull, you're tiring it out. He's right here somewhere. Oh, I see the line over there. Dude, I'm just pissed if it's a big fish, dude. Well, this is whatever it is, it's fighting like a mother. <laughs> bro, he's gonna snap my pole. You trying to let him, bro? Get the you can't get the fish. Bro, hold on, bro. I'm getting Ooh, bro. bro, Munchie fing fishing in 10 minutes, baby. Run that check, baby. Oh. Run that check, baby. Run that check, Munchie. Run that check, baby. That's what the I'm talking about. Woo! Run that footage, baby. Run that real footage right now. Yes. Woo! Woo! Yo, look at this. <laughs> yeah. Where's the bogo? Yeah. I told you I was getting a nine pounder today. Bro. <laughs> Ow. Woo! Yes, I'm hyped as Bro. What have I always told you about fish? Patience. And? 10 pounds and lower. <laughs> Quality over quantity. Nine pounds. <laughs> Bro, tell me something good, big dog. Oh, my skills not wanted that. <laughs> I want to dance now. <laughs> <laughs> How much, bro? Did I hit that nine. You broke my record. Bro, what is it? Hang on, I'm waiting on it to lock. Give me nine pounder, bro. Give me a nine pounder, bro. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> Give me a nine pounder. Eight point nine one. <laughs> That. Give me a nine pounder, baby. Woo! <laughs> Look at that. He set the new record, Give guys. Give it to me, baby. Hold it sideways. Okay. Put your hand under the belly. It ain't gonna. There's nothing to sting you back there. Come on, jump, bro. Give me a glove. Oh my god. <laughs> he said, "Oh my." Yeah, it's on camera. I don't care. My first year fishing. I don't care. Laugh at me, baby, but this is a nine-pounder. Look at that, guys. Type right here? Yep, right under the belly. Just pick them straight sideways. Look at that, bro. 8.9 what? 9-1? So he's got the record right now, guys. Look at that. What do you got to say, D'Angelo? I told you I was coming for that nine pounder today, baby. <laughs> All right, let's get some. Uh, we're gonna take some pictures, so I'm gonna stop the video. No he's on there. We got us a fish, guys. Got us a little. Oh, oh, oh! Yeah, right. This is a good fish. Yeah, right. Bro, this one's a good one. Yeah, it's gonna get off, bro. Cause you don't know how to get them in. Get the net, my man. It's right here. Woo! Woo! You're not real big, but it's about a six pound. probably about the same size as my other one. You think? No, oh, he's big. Yeah, that's about the same size as the other one. Okay. Yeah. Well. yeah. There we go, guys. Look at that. Wow, pretty fish. You ain't gonna weigh it? Yeah. Nice, nice looking fish. Kind of skinny. I mean, he's fat, but he's not as big as I'd expect him to be. Beautiful fish, though. Mungy fishing in the hizzy. 
Yes, sir. Still, I think D'Angelo's fish weighs more than all three of the ones I caught today. Bro, 10 pound me, please. We got the net for a one pound fish. no more because my scale broke and I have to get a new one but good fish either way. Yes sir. Yes. Two. Oh. Let go. Yeah, yeah. Think you got it? Yeah reel it in. Check that bait. Fuck. Throw it in the same spot. Same exact spot guys. Same pole, everything. His rod, he's just uh, going like a flathead at it. It very well could have been a flathead. Hey guys, I hope you all enjoyed today's episode. <clears throat> it's kind of windy, hard to hear, so I apologize for that. Uh, I had a couple businesses I wanted to give some shout outs to. Uh, back home in Texas, there's a place called Relentless Firearms and Tactics. Um, I ask that you please go give them a follow on Instagram as well as on Facebook. They're licensed and certified trainers that hold basic pistol and license to carry classes. They train in private lessons, basics, holster draw, long range rifle, and more. It is veteran owned and operated. They make things fun and safe, and they're going to be having some good deals and discounts on classes coming up soon. Uh, they hold classes at the Triple C Gun Range in Crescent, Texas, 365 days a year. So you guys can go and check them out on Facebook, Instagram. It's uh, Relentless Firearms and Tactics. Uh, also got um, here in Dewey, Oklahoma at 523 East Don Tyler Road, uh, Outdoor Adventure. They have a, it's a sporting goods store. They got guns and ammo, transfers, custom orders, unique items. For camping, fishing, hunting, they make trades. Uh, it's owned by Mark Wheat. And it says they're open Tuesday through Friday from 10 to 6 and Saturday from 10 to 5. So uh, be sure and go check these guys out at uh, Outdoor Adventures here in Dewey. And if you're in Independence, Kansas... Uh, feel free to stop by and check out uh, Clinton Blevins uh, Bait and Fishing Supplies at Shiner's Bait and Tackle at 1509 West Laurel Street, Independence, Kansas, 67301. Uh, I've seen these guys a couple times. I've been to their place several times. Uh, I've gotten bait from them. I've bought several rods and reels. Really nice people, really knowledgeable. Uh, go check them out and just tell them Mungie Fish, ugh, Mungie Fishing sent you. Uh, anyway, guys, thanks for watching the video. Again, I'm real happy for D'Angelo. Uh, this is his first year fishing, and he's really picked up on it. Um, I'm, I'm impressed with how good he's gotten. And I uh, hope you guys uh, consider liking this video. Give him a little bit of support. Let him know that we're there for him because uh, we all started at one point or another. So, uh, Also, if you haven't thought about subscribing yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that little notification bell so you know anytime we got new videos coming out. But I greatly appreciate you guys watching. Hope you guys come back. We'll see you again. Mungie Fishing.